Hello guys, so today I'm gonna be showing you how this sound was made. So originally the Mac startup sound came from a Korg Wave Station EX. The Mac startup sound was made when Jim Reeks played C major chord on the Korg Wave Station. And I'm gonna be showing you how that Korg Wave Station made the sound. So over here I have don't want to do this right now right now we have the Korg wave station vst here we don't have the actual one but that's completely fine because this one has all of the presets that the Korg wave station had so over here we go to sandman which is the original preset but it doesn't even sound like the original um so let's just slow this down to 120 and and let's make a C major chord. And there's a G in there as well. See, it starts at C3. Never mind. So, let's go over to edit and let's see what sounds are being played. Right now we got industrial. I know, but that doesn't say... That that doesn't sound like it was on the original. Maybe it could have been modified. Okay, so only two out of four of these are correct, I think, in my opinion, of testing these out. So we can mute this one for now because this won't work. Or we can mute this one for now because this isn't on the original sound as we we can mute this one now because we're going to be working on other parts of this sound so right now we're going to replace tambo tack tambo tack with with brassasan pad and right now that's really high so let's bring that down Now Aerovox, this one's 12 down. We can hear the how that sounds. So let's bring that up. And actually in this patch we have um we have some parts that are actually slowed down and sped up. So we can bring this one up. And right now that's already getting closer. But to, okay, let's increase the 80 to 99. And over here, let's bring that down a little bit so that it's, there's less of an attack. That already sounds better. Let's take a look at the air vox. Right now that's sounding a little bit bassy, so let's try out negative 12 and see if that works. And that seems to work really well. Now let's take the pluck and let's bring it down just a little bit. It's still in there. And I'm just, for the fun of it, let's try... Now over here, let's see how it sounds with just the strings. Now over here, we can obviously see that this is getting a little bit too loud. So let's bring this down to 80 as well. Keep on messing up that C chord. So now let's um, enable the synth pad and let's just bring it down a little bit more. 
then let's enable the plug. Now it's really really close. Let's just bring it down a little bit more to make it sound a little bit more airy, less airy. Okay, now we have our preset set up. We actually have to do one more step, which is to record it and slow it down because it was slowed down after recording it in the original. Now we slow it down to... And now that we have that... Wait, why is it not working? And that sounds really, really accurate. And that's how the Mac startup sound was made. <laughs>